Folks, quantum computing is no longer just a futuristic concept. It's becoming a reality right in front of our eyes, and the progress we've seen over the past year has been nothing short of remarkable. What was once considered decades away is now being tested in real-world applications, from AI acceleration to cybersecurity and even defense. And yet, analysts believe we are still very early in this technological revolution, with most of the market's biggest breakthroughs yet to come. That means investors who get in early could see substantial gains in the years ahead. While tech giants like IBM, Google, and Microsoft are all investing billions, it's actually the smaller, more focused, pure-play quantum companies that could deliver the kind of exponential returns early investors dream of. And that's exactly what I'm going to tell you today. In this video, I'm going to share with you three quantum computing stocks trading under $30 that I believe have the potential to become the next big thing in quantum world. Each of these companies has unique technology, strong catalysts, and the potential to ride the wave of quantum adoption into the mainstream. So if you're serious about investing and want to position yourself early in companies that could deliver massive gains, make sure to watch this video till the end. And if you are new here, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you never miss an update on the hottest stocks in the market. Let's aim for 200 likes on this video so more people can reach and benefit from this info. And remember folks, this video is for educational purposes only. I am not a financial advisor, and this is not a financial advice. Always do your own research before making any investment decisions. Now let's get into it. So, the first quantum stock on our list is D-Wave Quantum, trading under the ticker symbol QBTS on the New York Stock Exchange. Over the last year, this stock has transformed from being overlooked in the quantum computing sector into one of the most talked about small cap names, and for good reason. Currently trading at $25.31 per share and up an astonishing 2,482% in a single year, D-Wave has proven that investor sentiment can change overnight once breakthrough technologies begin to show real-world impact. What makes D-Wave unique compared to its peers is its specialization in annealing quantum computers. Unlike gate-based systems that companies like IBM and Google are pursuing, D-Wave's machines are designed to excel at optimization problems. These are some of the most practical and commercially relevant use cases in quantum computing today. Things like optimizing supply chains for logistics companies, finding the best allocation of resources for the military, or helping accelerate machine learning models for artificial intelligence. To put it into perspective, D-Wave has shown that its technology can solve problems in minutes that would take even the fastest classical supercomputers millions of years to calculate. That kind of performance edge is not just theoretical anymore. It is demonstrable and already being put to the test by research centers and enterprises around the world. The company has also taken a huge leap forward this year with the release of its Quantum AI Toolkit, a software platform that integrates D-Wave's quantum systems directly with PyTorch, one of the most popular machine learning frameworks in the world. For developers, this means that rather than working in an abstract experimental environment, they can now actually combine quantum computing power with widely used AI tools. This integration has the potential to accelerate breakthroughs in generative AI, drug discovery, financial modeling, and natural language processing, making D-Wave a frontrunner in the race to merge AI and quantum. Research centers in countries like Germany, Canada, and Japan have already reported measurable improvements in AI performance using D-Wave's machines, signaling that the toolkit is not just a proof of concept, but a practical solution for some of the most advanced computing challenges. From a financial standpoint, D-Wave is still operating like an early-stage technology company, growing revenues but also incurring heavy costs to fund research and development. In its most recent quarter, the company generated $3.1 million in revenue, which marked a 42% increase from $2.2 million in the same quarter the year before. That kind of growth is impressive, but operating expenses have also ballooned, rising 41% year-over-year to $28.5 million. This left D-Wave with an operating loss of $26.5 million for the quarter. On an adjusted EBITDA basis, the company reported a $20 million loss, up from $13.9 million last year. Losses widening is never something investors like to see. But with companies like D-Wave, investors are usually willing to tolerate short-term red ink in exchange for long-term growth potential. And here's where things get even more interesting. The company's cash position has skyrocketed to $819.3 million, representing a 1,900% increase from the previous quarter. That kind of liquidity gives D-Wave years of runway to fund research, sign contracts, and build commercial partnerships without immediate pressure to raise more money. For investors, this cash reserve is a big vote of confidence because it means the company can focus on scaling without worrying about survival. Analysts are watching closely to see how D-Wave leverages its strong cash position and rapidly growing revenues. At $25.31 per share, 
Some might think the stock has run too far, too fast, but given its 2,482% gain in the last 12 months, it is clear that Wall Street sees D-Wave as more than just a speculative bet. It sees it as one of the key players in making quantum AI commercially viable. The second stock on our list is Quantum Computing Incorporated, trading under the ticker symbol QUBT on the NASDAQ. This company has been one of the most explosive performers in the entire technology sector over the past year, with its stock surging 2,800% and climbing to around $18.85 per share. From being a relatively obscure name to becoming one of the top performing quantum stocks, QUBT's story is nothing short of remarkable. The company has differentiated itself in the crowded quantum computing space by developing cutting-edge photonic chip technology. These chips are designed to overcome some of the limitations of traditional superconducting qubits, such as scalability and error correction, and represent a pathway toward more practical, large-scale quantum systems. The big breakthrough that sent QBT stock soaring was the announcement of a massive $332 million cybersecurity contract with one of the top five banks in the United States. This contract not only provides significant revenue visibility, but also positions QUBT at the center of one of the most urgent global issues, cybersecurity in the age of quantum computing. As experts warn that quantum systems could eventually break existing cryptographic methods, the demand for quantum-resistant security solutions is expected to explode, and QUBT is one of the companies addressing that challenge head-on. Beyond its big contract win, QUBT has also gained institutional credibility. The company was recently added to the Russell Small Cap Index, which automatically increases its visibility among institutional investors and mutual funds. This has boosted ownership and liquidity, giving QUBT more stability as it executes its long-term strategy. On the flip side, its recent financial results highlight the risks of investing in early-stage quantum companies. In its most recent quarter, revenue dropped to just $61,000, down significantly from $183,000 in the prior year. Losses widened to $36.5 million, with earnings per share coming in at negative 0.26 compared to a forecast of negative 0.06. These numbers may look discouraging, but they don't tell the full story. Gross margins actually improved to 43%, up from 32% in the previous year, showing that the underlying economics of the business are getting stronger. Moreover, QUBT has $349 million in cash on its balance sheet which gives it the financial flexibility to continue investing in its new chip foundry in Tempe, Arizona. That facility is expected to be a critical driver of revenue once it ramps up over the next 12 to 18 months, allowing QUBT to scale its photonic chip production. The company's strategy also includes developing quantum sensing technologies and AI-driven reservoir computing, which further differentiate it from competitors. Trading at $18.85 per share, QUBT is valued at a multi-billion dollar market cap, and while this valuation is ambitious, given its current revenue base, investors are clearly betting on the long-term disruptive potential. For those with the patience to hold through volatility, QUBT offers exposure to both quantum hardware innovation and quantum cybersecurity, a rare combination in today's market. The third and final quantum stock on our list is Regetti Computing, trading under the ticker symbol RGTI on the NASDAQ. Regetti has delivered perhaps the most astonishing stock performance of them all, with its shares skyrocketing 3,700% in just one year. Currently trading at $29.64, Rigetti has emerged as one of the strongest pure plays in the quantum sector. Unlike some of its peers that focus solely on hardware or software, Rigetti operates as a full-stack quantum computing company, developing both the quantum chips themselves and the integrated cloud infrastructure to make them accessible. This approach has positioned Rigetti as a serious competitor to some of the larger tech giants because it can deliver a complete ecosystem for quantum computing. One of the company's most exciting developments came through a $5.8 million contract with the Air Force Research Laboratory, focused on creating systems that can bridge entanglement between superconducting qubits and optical photons. This work is highly technical but incredibly important because bridging those two systems could unlock scalable hybrid quantum networks, a critical milestone on the path to broader commercialization. Government contracts like these also provide Regetti with credibility, funding, and potential expansion opportunities as defense and national security applications for quantum computing are expected to grow dramatically. Regetti's financials reflect the challenges of operating at the cutting edge of technology. In its most recent quarter, revenue was $1.8 million, down from $3.1 million in the prior year, while gross margins slipped to 31% from 64%. Operating expenses rose to $20.4 million, and net losses widened to $39.7 million compared to $12.4 million the year before. These widening losses reflect the heavy investments Rigetti is making in R&D, talent, and infrastructure, but the company's balance sheet provides comfort. With $571.6 million in cash and no debt, 
Rigetti has the financial resources to weather near-term losses while continuing to advance its technology. Investors have clearly looked past the weak short-term numbers and are focusing on the long-term potential. One sign of this was the bullish analyst call from B. Riley Securities, which raised its price target on Rigetti from $19 to $35 and slapped a buy rating on the stock. That is one of the most aggressive target increases in the entire sector and signals that Wall Street is beginning to recognize Rigetti's unique positioning as a full-stack quantum player. At its current stock price of $29.64 and with such a dramatic 3,700% gain over the past year, Rigetti may seem like it has already priced in a lot of growth. But given the nascent stage of the industry, many believe that we are only scratching the surface of the upside if Rigetti becomes a leading provider of commercial quantum systems in the years ahead. To wrap things up, these three quantum computing stocks are each tackling the quantum challenge from different angles, and all three have delivered extraordinary stock market returns in the past year. They all trade under $30, they've all posted gains in the thousands of percent, and yet they're still in the early stages of commercialization. The risks are real, but the potential rewards are equally massive. For investors with high risk tolerance and a long-term vision, these could be the kinds of stocks that define the next big wave of technological disruption. If you enjoyed this deep dive into quantum stocks with massive upside potential, make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on notifications so you don't miss the next breakdown. Thanks for watching.